For years, Aggie football had been defined by beating Texas and coming up short in big games. Well, for head coach Kevin Sumlin to produce a Heisman winner, beat number one Alabama in their house, and be the surprise of the SEC, that mentality clearly had to go. Sumlin realized early on there was a problem with Aggie football. The target of winning was there, but the close but not quite culture of the team kept them from aiming for it. So how does a new coach fix that? Well, for Sumlin, the answer was simple. We didn't talk about it very much, what happened in the past. So, you know, it seemed to be what everybody wanted to talk about um, externally, but internally, we, we just didn't talk about it. And Sumlin's clean slate approach to the ghost of A&M's past was seen during the team's first SEC road trip. Anytime you have to to get over a hump or clear a hurdle, you, you've got to win a game in a certain fashion, you know, and to come behind, come from behind, win at uh, Mississippi at Ole Miss, I think really helped us. That win gave the players confidence in Sumlin and confidence they had the power to make the past just that. You guys had lost a bunch of games like that and able to go on the road and win. Regardless of what you say as a coach, you've got to be in that situation to be successful. And I think when that happened, a lot of things changed for, for our team. And one more thing Kevin Sumlin has the opportunity to change is A&M's fortune in the Cotton Bowl. The Aggies have lost in six straight appearances. The last time they won this game was in 1988 in a 35-10 win over Notre Dame. At Cowboy Stadium, Lane Fobbs, ABC 40 Sports. All right, one more, Dick, two, one.